Want to learn how to make this wonderful orange and golden syrup steam pudding using a steam oven? Then keep watching to see the full recipe. Welcome to Cooking in Style with Harvey Norman. It's easy to associate steam cooking with fish or fresh vegetables, but these incredibly versatile ovens are great for a variety of dishes, including desserts. To prove it, I'm going to show you how to make an orange and golden syrup steam pudding with vanilla yogurt. For a pudding that will serve around four, you're going to need one orange, three tablespoons of golden syrup, 175 grams of self-raising flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, 175 grams of unsalted butter, 175 grams of caster sugar, and three eggs. For the sauce, you will need one orange, one tablespoon of caster sugar, three tablespoons of golden syrup, and 20 ml of orange liqueur. And to finish off, for the vanilla yogurt, you will need 500 grams of natural or Greek yogurt, one tablespoon of golden syrup, and half a teaspoon of vanilla seeds. To get going with our pudding, Pour some golden syrup into the bottom of the pudding basin. Add in half the orange zest. This will give us a beautiful glossy top to the pudding when we turn it out later on. Now for the batter, place the flour and baking powder into our food processor. Add in the remaining zest, the butter, three eggs, our sugar and a dash of the orange juice. Really simple, give this a blitz until the mixture is nice and smooth. Push down the side to make sure there's no lumps. Okay, our batter's nice and smooth. Remove the blades and pour this over the top of the golden syrup. Level over the top. Because we're steaming the pudding, we're going to need to cover the top to make sure no condensation gets into our pudding. To do that, I've just got some greaseproof paper, which I've lined with some butter in case our pudding rises up so it doesn't stick. Place that over the top and secure with some tin foil. So our pudding is now ready. I'm going to place this into the steamer and cook for around two hours. Our pudding is cooked. While that rests for a few minutes, just to settle, I'm going to make our vanilla yogurt. Now to do this, I've just got some vanilla bean paste. Place about half a teaspoon into the natural yogurt and sweeten with a little more golden syrup. Give that a mix. And that's ready to go. And now for the unveiling. Let's see how our pudding's gone. It's smelling delicious. Now this can be quite nerve wracking. We need to turn the pudding out of the bowl. So just place a plate on top. This can be a bit of a tricky manoeuvre. One hand on the bottom and one hand on the top. And we're quickly going to flip this over. Let's see if this comes out. Fingers crossed. There we have it. Beautiful, it's looking nice and moist. Now I think we might serve some of this up. Just cut a nice big wedge. See how moist that is. To go with the pudding, I've just got a sauce here which I've mixed up and all it is is a mixture of orange juice, orange zest, some golden syrup and some orange liqueur and I've put this on the stove top and boiled it for about three or four minutes. Spoon some over the pudding, place some
place over some of the vanilla yogurt that we made earlier. This will cut through some of the sweetness. As a final garnish, I've placed some orange slices in with some water and sugar and just candied them. Let's place that on top. And there's our finished dish, a beautiful moist orange and golden syrup pudding. So there you have it, a steam pudding to spoil your taste buds. Not only do steam ovens lock in vitamins and minerals for healthier meals, they also make for incredibly moist baked goods. Plus they're energy efficient and feature doors that are cool to touch. Cleaning is a breeze with the steam clean feature of this model. For a classic steam dish, click here to see our steamed salmon with tahini yogurt and quinoa salad. Or for more information about steam and steam clean ovens, including demonstration videos, click the link. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time for Cooking in Style with Harvey Norman.